pen cactus father's day card okay you're going to need a piece of paper some newspaper sharpie colored pencils watercolors acrylic paints rubbers a whole heap of different stuff for this do what you can I'm actually going to create two cactuses but you only need to do one I'm just going to show you two different ways of doing creating your cactus so I'm doing one here on newspaper just to give a little bit of a different quirky feel and then I'm going to do one on just white paper which is what we might have at home but just in case you don't have white paper at home newspaper is fine outlining um, in Sharpie if you can't draw straight away in Sharpie always sketch it out in pencil first and then go over in Sharpie if you don't know what cactuses look like go and have a look on the internet and see what different types of cactuses you can find and you can draw a cactus that you might think suits your dad better than the two I've drawn here but these are just ideas so you can create your cactus to look however you want all right now we need to color them you can use oil pastels watercolor acrylic paint um, pencils wind up crayons but I'm going to use on my white piece of paper here some oil pastels in two different greens so it's got a little bit of texture and then I'm going to paint over it in green watercolor so I'm actually going to give a bit of a brush over the whole cactus in water first to do that wet on wet sort of look um, and then finish it off in the green paint so for our oil pastel watercolor cactus there on white paper now if it goes outside the lines don't stress about it you can always cut it out because um, you're going to have to cut out the newspaper one anyway um, on the newspaper when I used a green acrylic paint I just love using different types of materials and we have these at home so it's easy for me but it might not be easy for you so you could use a different type of material so once they're cut once you have done your cactus now it's time to draw the character of your cactus now I'm going to put a hat here on this cactus so I just need to do the outline to get an idea of how big the head of the cactus is this is because I'm going to draw a baseball cactus so you might have a dad who likes baseball or might like softball or you might have a dad who likes gardening so here I'm about to draw a gardening hat um, he might like cooking so you could do a chef hat you he might be a builder so you could put on his builders um, belt with all his tools and stuff in it or a toolbox so what we're going to try and do is draw at least three things that our dad needs for what we want him to look like or what we, he does or what he likes so um, you might be a surfboard with some board shorts and a bar of wax or a towel or it might be that he's a builder so he might need all these tools for building um, he might like cooking the barbecue so he might want to put a bib with his barbecue tools um, he might like going to the snow so you might want to put a beanie on him with maybe some gloves totally up to you what you want to do here I'm drawing a chef's hat with a bow tie because he may be a chef or he might just really enjoy cooking and you think he's the best cook in the world so when he comes out with his cooking stuff he has the silver tray platter and, and everything so not everything here is just three items as the chef there I've got the hat the bow tie the platter and the knife and fork once you've decided on your three to five items it's time to color them in okay so a good idea is to outline first in sharpie before you start coloring and then color them in in crayon or something so <clears throat> we have a variety of different things now we need eyes and a mouth for our cactus so the eyes are really simple just two circles in pencil then I've used my sharpie to do the pupils in the middle make them a decent size and then using a red crayon or red texture or red pencil decide on the shape of mouth that you want so there's a couple of different mouths there also wherever you put the pupil of the eye shows where the pupil is looking all right now you need to cut them out and here we go I'm just going to show a variety of what I've created and you're not meant to create all these different types of materials for your dad you just have to create your three to five items 
and your eyes and your nose. This is just to show you the variety of different ways that you could create your dad. So we have the chef, we have the surfer, we have the gardener, we have the chef. <clears throat> we have the worker with his tie and his briefcase, and we have the baseball, and we have the mechanic or the builder. Now I want to add a pot to my cactus. He wants to just put him in a pot, so he's growing out of something. So I've just um, drawn here a pot and coloured him in brown glued him on and now I'm gluing on my eyes bow tie not a bow tie either it's a tie now I actually cut out that uh, cactus I found he was too tall for my chef's hat and then I'm actually now going to put a pot around him a little bit more decorative one I thought that brown one was I like it but I think we can do something a little bit more creative so outline your pot you could change whatever pot shape you want remember it doesn't have to look exactly like mine add a little bit of detail and then color it in so i'm just adding a bit of color to mine is a bright fun pot to put my chef cactus in i'm going to glue it on and voila there's my chef cactus in a pot and my working dad in a pot now he needs his prickles because cactuses all have spiky prickles so i'm just going to get my sharpie going around adding some prickles coming from on the cactus to off onto the paper there he is. Now don't forget this is a card so you probably need another piece of A4 paper to glue to it to the other side so that when you open it up you can write in there have a fan cactus father's day. Have fun.